Thank you. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you very much indeed. Thanks. It's perfect. Thank you very much indeed. Kent has long been known, of course, as the Garden of England, but producing Kent's Soul to Soul Fish Trail actually combines not only those amazing ingredients that we have here in the county, but also the fantastic coastline as well. This home-produced cod, literally, that fish has come out of the sea just a few hours before. I'm going to tuck in, but to tell us more about the scheme, here's Julie Muckman from Producing Kent. Saving the food miles is really, really important. And you know what? There's nothing like eating fresh fish. You know, you can so tell the difference between frozen fish and fresh fish. And, and it's about how you cook it as well. Um, but, you know, we've been very lucky here. We've had... Um, expert chef to cook it for us but you know it's so easy it's really easy to cook and really really gorgeous to eat what have we had today for our wonderful lunch we've had mackerel we've had pollock we've had cod we've had haddock we've had scallops um, so you know never ending and if you're a fish fan it's just it's just an absolute heaven the range of seafood available in kent is huge as is the methods of cooking it one used at the Coast Guard goes back to Roman times. Sam is the chef at the pub. This is local mackerel. It's actually been cooked on pebbles from the beach, which we've, um, we've cooked and then we've boiled for a long, long time. And then we've actually laid them into trays. The pebbles are incredibly hot. You could probably might still be able to hear them sizzling. And then we put the mackerel on them, um, just with herbs from the garden, and um, literally cooked them in the way that the Romans would have cooked them, um, sort of many hundreds of years ago when they first landed just up the road. Raising the profile of everything produced in the county is essential to Produced in Kent, who introduced the Soul to Soul fish trail. Amanda Cottrell is the organisation's patron. Today here at the Coast Guard, we're looking with optimism towards a future where local people buy local fish. And, um, and the food we've had here today has been absolutely delicious. Anyone who's tasted it couldn't doubt that local native fish, as they call them here, is, is um, the, the fish that we should be buying and eating. And it's the same argument as for local food in the Garden of England. And here on the coast of Kent, it, it, it's lunacy for us to be importing fish from Thailand when we have this extraordinary fish being caught just 100 yards away in the sea around it. Producing Kent's Soul to Soul fish trail is not only good news for the fisherman, the fishmonger, but also the county's restaurants, hotels and pubs like this one. Julie Maddox outside the Coast Guard at St Margaret's Bay for your Kent TV.